<laughs> and now the Phillies, by the way, one game, can. one game under that 500 level again. They're getting there. Heading in the right direction, I think. Absolutely. Now they're finding ways to win. And they're doing Instead it. Instead of finding, finding ways yeah, to win. Yeah, they're lose. doing it. Obviously, the starting pitching. And I said it would have been criminal if they lost this game tonight because Ranger Suarez was just outstanding tonight. Eight strikeouts. Uh, they gave up a first inning run. And then after that, he just settled down, gave him six strong innings. And the starting pitching has really come into form here for the Philadelphia Phillies and giving their ball club a chance to get some runs behind them. We'll have more on Ranger in a little bit right now. We got Rob Thompson over at Citizens Bank Park. Another sign. I'm oh, sorry. No, go for it, Mike. Another sign of this out team that shows this thing like is he again, Mike. Yeah, you know. Um, another walk off win. Felt pretty good. Um, get a three run lead and give it back to him, and then just keep battling. And finally, we get the Schwarber home run. But this is this is who they are. They're they're tough. They're mentally tough, and they're poised. They don't get sped up. Uh, I thought Ranger was. Fantastic. He really was. He was in the, the, the fifth inning when he went through um, Betts and Freeman and Smith, three punch outs. That was as good of an inning as I've seen him have probably in his career. It, it was really, really good. He was really sharp tonight. What does it mean to win uh, a walk-off run against a team of this caliber? Well, yeah, I mean, they're a good team. They, they swing the bats. And they showed it tonight that they, they can score quickly. Um, getting a walk-off win against anybody is good. Um, but, you know, with what happened out in L.A., it, it feels good. What do you like about how Alvarado and Soto, after, you know, strong kids of the league, what do you like about what Alvarado and Soto then did in the next two innings? Well, you know, Al, Alvy gives up the leadoff double, and then he just settled in and, and pitched and kept pitching, and his stuff, with, his cutter was really really good velocity was good i think he was maybe a little bit rusty especially early in the inning but uh and soto was really good that you know after what uh what he went through in la and coming back and and giving us that inning was was strong kimbrell and sir anthony were both down tonight it was at this time last year you started to see a turnaround this season and whatnot are we at that at that point where it was Few weeks before the All-Star break, where the season is starting to kind of come around, yeah. yeah, you can't guarantee anything, but we're certainly playing better baseball right now than we were earlier in the season, and you know we just got to stay consistent, um, come out, come out here every day, and and um, get after it. How much confidence do you have every time Schwarber comes to play right now? Yeah, you know, quite a bit. <laughs> it's that time of year. Yeah. But, I mean, what would he be like out of his at-bats in his last week? Well, he's, he's driving the ball, and he's taking his walks. You know, I think he had two walks tonight, triple, a home run. That's uh, what a leadoff hitter does. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was fantastic. Suarez's stuff seems to be taking up every single start. Yeah. Is that your observation? Yeah, absolutely. And and I think he's getting a feel for his change. And his curveball is really good right now. And the velocity's jumping up. So, um, yeah, he's been really good. Now, now it's been, I don't know, three starts in a row. So keep that going. Thank you. Well, we'll be talking a little bit more about Ranger Suarez when we return. More from the clubhouse. You're watching Philly's Post Game Live, presented by Cure Audio Auto Insurance. Philly's Post Game Live is presented by Cure Auto Insurance. See how much you can save at Cure.com. 